In this tutorial, we are going to learn how to add a path to our tour. There are two ways that you can add a path. You can click on Add at the top menu and then click Path, or you can click on the Add Path icon. The first thing that you need to do is type in the name of your path. From You can also type in a description for your path. In the description, you can type in the activity that you want your students to do when they come to this path. For this activity, we will be using the ruler tool along with the path to create a path that students can measure. Before you click OK, you can start drawing your path. The path drawing tool works a lot in the same way as the polygon tool. You can click on different points to create the path or you can click and drag. You can also click on the style and color tab and select a color that stands out for the path. You can click the width and make it a thicker path and you can also change the opacity. The path tool also has the ability to be raised from the ground. You can also create a wall with the path tool by extending the path to the ground. We can go back and change our color so that our area matches our, our line color. So now we created a wall using our path tool. If we do not want a wall, we can deselect this option and bring our path back down to ground. Once you have clicked OK, your path has been created. Now students can click on the ruler tool and measure the path that you created for them. The path tool can be used in many different ways. It can be used to measure distances. It can also be used to encircle an area, to draw attention to an area, to take students from one point to another point, and it can also be used to create walls.